Discard is back. What's up, nerds? After playing Darkin quite a bit, I can confidently say that uh, he is much better in Discard than he is in Silver Surferless or even Destroy. The main reason for this that I can tell is that you don't have to actually play out the Muramasa Shard to trigger Darkin's effect. With cards like Colleen Wing and Modok, we can just play out Darkin and be pretty confident that he is going to be a 3 energy 8 power card by the end of the game. This list has been performing super well for me. I'm currently 25 and 9 with it, with an average cube rate of about 1.24. So with Morbius, Collector, and Dokken, we have three different cards that are hard to deal with and are pretty big for the energy cost. It makes this list just that much harder to beat because you can play into all three lanes and the opponent has to respect each of those cards and the power they can output. Collector also gets plus one power with the shard going into your hand, so that's cute. Everything else is pretty simple. The only card I would point out here is Iron Lad. Iron Lad is basically our backup in case we don't draw our Dracula, Morbius, or Modok. As far as substitutions go, Iron Lad would be the substitution spot. I would suggest just running uh, Swordmaster there. But if you want to get really cute with Dokken, I guess you could run Nakia or something like Okoye. But really just replace Iron Lad with some other discard effect. But that's it. It's discard. You know the deck. Talking over. Game start. All right, Nid of Lear is... As long as we get Swarm, it's okay. But I want to put Collector in the Vault. Um, We're going to put Morpheus. <laughs> uh, we're going to put Morbius at the Vault. And then uh, we could basically ignore the Vault at this point. Okay. If this is oh, this is Galactus. That's why he turn turn one snapped me. Um, uh, I think we can just Iron Lad. Galactus, and then he's gonna Spider Man. Um, could do this and this. <laughs> That's kind of cool. Sure. Oh, wow. I expected Spider-Man. Okay, well, um, that's... Ooh, this is quite a lot of power, actually. Okay. So now he's going to go up to 32 power. Yeah, I ain't mad at that. I mean, Shang-Chi beats us, but... Eh. <laughs> Wakanda forever. Nah. Um, yeah, turn sevens are totally okay with this deck. It just gives us an additional turn to do things. Um, yeah, we play Collector out. And then whatever else gets pulled other than Wolverine here is fine. Go! Thank you. Okay, so this is a destroy deck. Oh, and of course Wolverine gets yoinked. You jerk. I don't want to play any of these. We just play Dracula next turn. Okie doke. Yeah. Uh, that, that. We can put Dracula there. Okay. Okay. Alright, well that's good. Um, we can do... We should... Let's put stuff in the middle. I'm okay with just discarding Iron Lad. It's whatever.
Oh, discard bounce. That's cute. Okay, yeah, so we're gonna draw Chavez here. I'm gonna put that with Collector. Um, that way we're forcing him to respect every single lane. We can do this here just to go up by like anything uh, there. And then we can play Modok over here. And um, yeah, this makes it to where like he makes one wrong decision, he loses. Okay. Yeah, I mean, that sucks. He loses over there. Uh, we tie at DC and then uh, we win by more than what we lose by in the middle. So, yep, good game. Oh, that's super good. Um, there's do Morbius over there. Maybe we start with Collector. Just to not make him be like, well, I'm going to use Enchantress there. So yeah, I'll just put Collector there. I do this. Okay, if he doesn't have Enchantress, this is gonna be awesome. I don't think I even want Dracula. We don't have Apocalypse, so there's no point. Can't we do this? I'm actually not going to play Modok at Sinister London because um, that's too many swarms in the hand, actually. Let's just do this. Right? No. Okay. I mean, this is only four swarms in hand. Yeah, this is fine. Friendly neighborhood Spider -Man here. Okay. I still think we're okay. Yeah, and then middle is just, uh, <laughs> I mean, that's a lot of power. I guess an Enchantress would suck, but, you know, whatever. Yee yee. Victory. Um, yeah, this is a pretty good curve. Morbius into Dokken, into Dracula. And then we just need to pull any sort of discard. We should be all right. Okay, um, a lot of people recently got Galactus, so I'm going to put Doc in here, so that cuts off a Galactus play over there, basically, and then we'll put Dracula in the middle. 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 Okay. Win the lockdown deck, that's fine. Doc and Morbius at one lane. I kind of not care about that lane anymore. I'll put this here. Okay. I suppose we do have to be a little careful now. Um... I think we can just play Colleen over here. Do, do I just want to go Iron Lad? I, I mean, the top of our deck is Collector, Modoc, Apocalypse, or Chavez. We're drawing Chavez next turn. Let's just do Wing here. And, and nothing. And nothing else. Okay. 
Yep, we do Travis here. Thank you. Um, so we're gonna put Modok here because uh, our Morbius is gonna get so ridiculously big. I don't think we need the extra power over there. And Dracula might end up discarding a swarm. So yeah, we're doing this. I mean, I guess Rogue would suck, but said, whatever. All right, that's about as good as you can get. Interesting. Well, you still win. <laughs> All right. Cool. Yeah. Good game. Uh, Morbius or Collector would be nice, even Colleen. But yeah, I mean, this is fine. Docking into Dracula and Iron Lad is back up. Brood. Super rude. Okay. So, um, let's see. Well, our next card is going to dictate where our Dokken goes. I think Dokken should go here. And then I think Dracula should go here. So yeah, we'll do this. Okay, um, not totally sure why he would put... Anyways, uh, let's put Dracula here. I mean, is Killmonger maybe is about to hit? I don't think I really care about that. Yeah, okay. Well, yeah, I mean, he's got a free death, so that's gonna suck. Um, let's put Modok over here. Gonna put Modok here. We'll go up on the left by quite a bit. Oh no. Enough said, Bob. Oh no, so he's got two deaths. Um Should I put one over there? I mean this all Depends on where he puts his deaths. I, I, maybe he can put one there. So maybe I should do this. Expecting him to go death, death. And if I put this here, that puts him out of range of winning. The yeah, I'm doing this. He's going to play death on Shadowlands, death on Onslaught. What? That was an insane play, but thank you for making it because we win. Good game. Victory. Uh, yeah, pass. Good hand though. Oh my god. This deck is at a 78% win rate at the moment. That's pretty good. Um... More, let's do Morbius at Hellfire. I, 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 every time I see Daredevil, I think Galactus now, especially with the Spotlight Cache. Okay. We'll put Dracula here. Oh, alright. I don't know what's happening. <laughs> um... And then why is he snapping so confidently? Let's put Modok here and it doesn't matter if he Spider-Man's either of those, I still can win. Oh. Wish I wouldn't have played Modok. <laughs> Enough said, Bob. 
Okay. Um, let's play Chavez over here. Playing Chavez over there it gives me a shot to win all three lanes, so I'm cool with that. All right. Let's do Swarm there. Sure. That Magneto screwed us. But, I mean, maybe we win with the cheeky Swarm on the right. Oh my god, we did. Oh. Oh. Even if I discard Sif, I win. <laughs> yeah, I mean, that guy... Those was, are was some good plays. But, uh... Still pulled it out. Nice. I like squirrels in real life. I want to kill them in Marvel Snap. Hate you. Hate you. Okay. Um... Yep, yeah, we'll just collect her. I'm gonna be tight on board space, especially with a bunch of swarms. But collector's gonna get big. Dawkins quite nice. Dawkins will go there. What a massa. Okay. I'm, I am okay with this. Okay with this result. Um. Think, yeah, we just played Colleen. It's fine. We can play it uh, where. Call uh, where Collector is Colleen Collector, and then Modok can go to Titan. Okay. I mean, I guess an Odin might suck, but not really. I think we still get plenty big. Yeah, okay. That does suck. Um, but don't see how he gets to 16 power there and I don't see how he wins on the right maybe Shang-Chi okay Victory. recording for this list was incredibly simple we are at a 76% win rate 62 net cubes with an average cube rate of 1.44 what the hell maybe it's just the beginning of the season people are testing stuff but um I mean, you saw those games we played against every a different a different deck every game. So I can't chalk it up to that, to be honest. I think this deck is just really sick, really consistent, and uh, I'm all giddy, as you can tell. But yeah, give this list a try. It's really great. Dokken is absolutely worth the season pass, and uh, I can't wait for the rest of the season. But yeah, thank you so much for watching this far. I uh, appreciate uh, Mouthy for being a two-month subscriber. What's up, dude? See you on the ladder. Also, if you're watching, I'm sorry for not fist bumping you the last time we played. I always feel bad when I do that, <laughs> but that's all I got. Thank you guys so much. See you in the next video. Later, nerds.